Today is April 18, 2018, and Disney Channel is now 35 years old this year. And to celebrate 35 years of Disney Channel from 1983 to 2018, this video is a crossover between Hi Hi Puffy Army Me and Dad Whoop Dean Hunger Force called Puffy Army Me and Kez meets Frowd at Me Twid and Master Shake. Enjoy. Well girls, here we are. Well, a new neighborhood. I've never seen it before. Me neither. Let's just get off the bus and enter the house, shall we? We shall. Frylock, will you go get the door? Sure. Hello there, I'm Kaz Harada, and this is Puffy Amiyumi. We're here for a visit. Can we come on in? Sure. Although Mimi and Twid and Shake haven't ever met you guys before. Man, I have never seen these people before. Me neither. That's right. Why don't we all introduce each other to every one of you guys and shake hands? Hello there, my name's Kaz. My name's Master Shake. It's nice to meet you, Kaz. Sup. My name's Yumi. Nice to meet you too. My name's Frylic. Hello, little meat boy. My name's Arnie. I'm the cutest girl the world has ever seen. It's a pleasure to meet you, pretty girl. My name's Meatwood. Yumi and I brought our music album with us. Would you like to let me play it on your jam box for you? Yeah. I bet I'd really like all them songs. Ami and I are from Japan. We joined each other and became best friends. And we also made up our own band called Puffy Ami Yumi. That's because we're rock and roll stars. Lots of people love us, but Yumi and I like each other because we're friends, even though we're really good with the Japanese language. Japanese? Wait a minute, I spoke Japanese when Travis of the Cosmos came. Man, what a surprise that was. Question. Do you girls have families? Families? Well, I have a mom, a dad, and a brother. My mom's name is Chiyo, my dad's name is Takuya, and my brother's name is Ryo. All I have is just a mom. Her name is Misaki. Okay, so you have parents. How about any cousins? We do. My cousins are Erika and Yuri. And my cousins Julie. Ami, I have another question. Does your brother have a best friend? He sure does, and his best friend is a girl. Her name is Femi, even though she's just as cute as I am. I have another question for the both of you. Did you girls have a TV show? Of course we did. It's called Hi Hi Puffy Ami Yumi. Did you know that Hi Hi Puffy Ami Yumi rolls 2001 loves that show? Yes, he, he does. does. Okay okay, and do you guys know why he loves it? He, he hates SpongeBob, SpongeBob SquarePants. Yes, he hates SpongeBob. Why? He hates it because of the speed of the cell animation on the first three seasons from 1999 to 2004. And like we did in the debut of the new channel, every time he sees a clip or image of SpongeBob creative directed by Derek Dryman, he gets so extremely pissed off that he has to watch Hi Hi Puffy Ami Yumi really really badly and then writes stuff like I hate Spongebob, Nickelodeon without Spongebob April 1st 1979 to April 30th 1999, the world without Spongebob January 1st 200,000 BCE to April 30th 1999, 
and then he reads the years of the world without Spongebob from 1600 to 1998, because Spongebob started going on since May 1, 1999, and is still on the air to this day. It's the longest-lived Nicktoon on TV, but we want it gone right now. Whoa! Never heard about High High Puffy Army Me Rules 2001 hating Spongebob before. But by the way, how long did your show last on Cartoon Network? Well, it first aired on November 19, 2004, which was the day the Spongebob Squarepants movie was released, and it only lasted until June 27, 2006. So, our show's the shortest-lived cartoon on Cartoon Network. Ami's right. And one other thing I should say. It had no Halloween episode. What? What the hell? No Halloween episode? What a freaking bummer. I know. But the good thing is, even though Hi Hi Puffy Ami Yumi Rules 2001 revived us on YouTube when his channel was still called Jake Crader, he has lots of custom characters that never existed in our show that he made all by himself. The first three characters he ever made were Kiki, Limai, and Mimi. Their characters he made as babies, and then by May. His next two were Rio and Chio, and then came Violet, Zoe, and Ned, and then Takuya and Emmy, and then by September he made Erika and Yuri, and then a month later he made Serena, which is a villain. And even though Hi Hi Puffy Amiyumi had no Halloween episode in 2005, Hi Hi Puffy Amiyumi Rules 2001 helped Puffy Amiyumi celebrate their very first Halloween ever in October 2017. So with further ado, he made the Halloween episode himself and called it Hi Hi Halloween, and was uploaded to YouTube four days before Halloween. All thanks to my brother. I love it when he helps us celebrate Halloween. It makes us so happy. Not to mention he did a wonderful job giving us the perfect costumes to wear that year, even though he decided to be a ghost that year. We like it when he's a ghost. Yeah, and then three days before Halloween, he made two more custom characters called Baku Paku and Chizu, which are parodies of Map and Backpack from Dora the Explorer. And then by Christmas, he made Cowgirl Casey. Later in January of this year, he made Misaki and Rentaro. And last week he uploaded an episode called Ami the Explorer, The Legend of the Lost Treasure. We bet that by October of this year, he's gonna have us celebrate Halloween again in our second Halloween episode called Julie and the Great Pumpkin. Wow. What an awesome user he is. Another question. Do you girls have a Christmas episode? No. But we will this year. More cool. I bet I'd be glad to see that. Master Shake, more questions. How long has Aqua Teen Hunger Force been running? Well, it started as a pilot on New Year's Eve 2000, and then it was moved to Adult Swim in September 2001. After 2006, we went on break from airing episodes and released a movie called The Aqua Teen Hunger Force colon movie film for theaters on April 13, 2007. Did you girls have a movie during your show's run? No, we didn't. Oh. Guess hi hi Puffy Ami Yumi Rules 2001 is gonna have to make it for ya, huh? But anyways, after we released the colon movie, we returned to airing episodes in 2008 starting with season 5, and then in 2011, a year after the last episode of season 7 aired, the show's name was changed from Aqua Teen Hunger Force to Aqua Unit Patrol Squad 1. And then a year later it was changed again to Aqua something you know whatever. And then another year later it was changed again to Aqua TV show show. And since 2014 doesn't have any episodes of us, we returned in 2015 with the shows named finally changed to Aqua Teen Hunger Force Forever. And then after the last episode of Aqua Teen Hunger Force Forever aired, the show was cancelled. Sad truth is was that it never reran. Shakes right. When Adult Swim cancels some of their original shows like Sea Lab 2021 and Harvey Birdman Attorney at Law, Adult Swim lets them be gone for life because Adult Swim does not rerun their original shows. They don't? No. They don't. Never. At least Cartoon Network, Disney Channel and Nickelodeon rerun their original shows. So I guess that's how long our show lasted. Yeah. But anyways, 
We are very glad to have you and these girls for a visit at our headquarters cause. Wanna go outside and play golf with me? Sure. You know me, Ed. I've never been for a visit here. Yeah, by the way, I have my friends such as Roxy Brown. You know, the one who's the box with a face with a mustache drawn on it and has groovy hair. That's who he is. And you can hear his jazz music whenever he talks. Really? How sweet. I've got this hairbrush if you girls would like to give me a massage. You can probably comb my hair. You can feed me some pizza. You can play your music on your music on my jam box. So what? What ya girls think? I don't know me it would. We should prop.